Guys, the chicken is here. We are back today with another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, we're going to unlock a bunch of stuff. We got rocket launchers. We got them up to tick three. And we're also going to be able to place a doom cannon. So I'm pretty excited to see how this is going to turn out. I'm hoping that this is going to be a nice push point for us. Like, um, what was it the other day that we did? Um, whatever it was that got us to, to rank 18. Make sure to check out yesterday's video if you haven't seen it yet. But uh, yeah, let's go. Let's go. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to get rockets up to tick three. Now, I've got the base for them already. Um, and we're also going to go ahead and grab a Doom Cannon. So I'm hoping that this puts us ahead. Now, I actually got smoked by tanks this morning. Yes, believe it or not, tanks are pretty meta right now. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to place... Whoops, I know what a boom mine is. I'm going to place the rocket here. And we're going to put the Doom Cannon right about there. And let's put, uh, let's put this back in here somewhere. And I don't know, let's put this up there. So I'm thinking... That this is gonna work. Now this base, I switched to it, and it's um, it's hit and miss. It's hit and miss. They're always kind of like that, but uh, I think we got we got all the tools, we got everything we need now to uh, to go ahead and progress. So let's see if um, <clears throat> we're able to make something out of this. So I know a lot of you guys are still unable to get chests and things like that. Like I've been saying, um, if you don't have a lot of tech, it just go straight to bullet. Get bullet. Um, heavy rush. Try to get to one engine. Um, if you're stuck in the sky shield bases, just let your troops run free, and then they will wrap around the corner and go underneath the sky shield. Hopefully, gri grab one uh, engine room for you. So, what my base is a little bit weak to right now is barrage. So, we're gonna see those players uh, do pretty well. But for the most part, nobody should be really clearing us fully. Uh, we'll see. I might eat my words on that one, but uh, that that is the idea of the base. Now, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna flare them up over this way. And let's start to clear out some of these mines that are going to be an issue. I'm going to try to stay upwards on the right-hand side. So let's see if that helps us out at all. And now let's go. We're going to have to bring them back here in a sec, I think, because some of them are going to walk over to that flamethrower, which we don't need. We need them to go this way, not that way. <clears throat> and, yeah, so we're just going to try to stay on this right side. And walk up towards uh, towards that uh, that corner, and then try to angle and come down that way. I find that's the best way to do any of these style of attacks. Um, you don't want your troops splitting up. Ah, those Zookas are determined to go to that flamethrower. I probably should have taken that out first, but it's okay. Let's get a little knuckle here going. Now let's flare them up this way. Let's throw a shock down here. Careful in that mortar. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Have you guys uh, experienced that as well? It feels like, I don't know, with these bases, it's it's like, it, it seems like all of this stuff is like, oh, there's there's no way, you know, there's no way they're going to clip that mine. Even if they do, there's no way it's going to kill all of them. Um, but it always does, every single time. It's like, it, it's like clockwork. Um, you know, whenever there's a weird mortar shot like that, um... Or if they're ever just like on the outskirts of a mine and it just pops and blows all of them up. Uh, it seems like it never fails. I don't know. Super frustrating. But uh, there we go. Alright, so we unlocked the good stuff and now we're losing. That's usually how Warships works. I want to see what he did though, at least. You know, honestly, that was just a bad attack by me. Um, if they're heavy rushing to get one engine, uh, we shouldn't really be losing at all. Um... You know, considering we have bullet at rank four, we should be able to get, um, <clears throat> we should be able to fully clear pretty well every base that we come against. All right, so that was a one-off. That was a one-off, right? Let's uh, let's reload here and see what we got. So one, two, three, four, one, one, two, three. This one, let's try to be less fancy and just kind of come at it straight away, because um, you know all we need to do is get two engines pretty well. I think we're getting two plus engines each hit. We should be secured to win. <clears throat> but we'll see how this goes. Um, okay. Let's take out some of these guys over here. Let's take out this nasty little clump right there. And what else do we want going? Let's actually go one right here. Right on that line. Okay. That was good. That was good. You can kind of tell when they come around the corner if you're going to take out the base or not. 
Um, the hardest thing is just getting Bullet into a decent position. I gotta take out this mine here really quickly. Um, we don't need to use Shock Knuckles because Bullet's just gonna throw it over the ship into the ocean. So we can hold on that for right now. It'll be nice to actually have that in a second. I'm gonna use one now. You see, we only got, uh, but we got all the mines out of the way. So we're looking pretty good here. If Bullet ever turns into a decent angle, we can use Shock Knuckles. There we go. There we go. Um, Alright, so we need those critters to go down and pop those two mines. I think those are still in range of the Zookas. There we go. And let's go like this. Bingo, bango, bongo. That's looking solid. That's looking a lot better. 225. That's a nice time too. Oh, yeah. Okay. Now let's see what he's doing. Perfect. Perfect. Heavy Rush 1ER. That's exactly what we want. If that's all they're getting on us, then that's that's good stuff. That's good stuff. Let's get into another one here. Yeah, so <clears throat> today's the day we need to get into Diamond. Hopefully we can pull it off. I'm not sure just yet. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. You see, we're still using 5-3 um, Heavy Zooka. That's what all the guys are using right now. Um, that That's still definitely um, the way to go. And that hasn't really changed yet. Some people are using tanks. Tanks are going to clear the base, but just keep in mind that they are slow. So, I mean, they're not going to be perfect either. One, two, three. Now, when I'm doing critters like that, I like to throw them all out at once. All that does is it just simply allows us, um, allows some of the other critters to also distract. Um, let's actually bring bullet down this way. Come on, Bullet. Come on, come on, come on. I know you want to go this way. I know you want to. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> How many times do I have to flare Bullet down? And he, he's just not going to listen. <laughs> Maybe I need to start delay dropping him or something. I don't know. I seem to always have that issue where he just loves running up to the top. In that stupid corner and then he doesn't get any value out of his shock knuckles. Um, okay. <clears throat> Let's shock right here again. We need critters or we're not going to clear this fully. We need them, we need them, we need them. Actually, I think we're all going to get roasted here. we got to bring him back this way. I should have let him finish that engine first. That was dumb. Um. Nope, they're still going to go into that mine, eh? Okay. Now, if I can flare them down, we're obviously going to get a really bad time here. But if I can flare them down like this, we should be able to finish everything. It just depends if he's going to fully clear us or not. He shouldn't be able to, given our base. I mean, it's not impossible, but it should be pretty unlikely. Okay, there we go. The good thing is we'll rip through that one engine in a very quickly. Boom, there we go. Very nice. Oh, no, he did take us down. Shoot. Well, <clears throat> we got the base down at least. Now we're looking at a base race. 156, we were right there. I want to see what he did, though. Surely he didn't use tanks, not with a Doom Cannon. Bullet. Heavy Zooka. Okay. Um, Alright, let's see what he did here. Just shock knuckles, eh? Wow. Huh. That's pretty surprising. I mean... I don't know. I want to say that's a one-off, but uh, obviously... <coughs> obviously it worked, so... Let's try it again. Let's try it again and see what we got. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three... So this guy's got a Doom Cannon, he's got Boom Cannons, uh, this is going to be tougher for heavies. But uh, let's see what we can figure out here. Okay, let's go like that, like this, and like this. Open up all those mines, most of them anyways. Yeah, Doom Cannons are nice because typically people will waste like two or three shocks on them. Just like I'm doing right now. 
Let's go. Come on, bullet. Oh my god, man. <laughs> like... Okay. Just hit something facing the other defenses. Okay, let's shock here. Ah, as if we missed that machine gun. That's going to rinse half our zooks right there. Actually, it wasn't too bad. I thought it was going to smoke more of them. Okay. Yeah, we're going to hit all these mines anyway, so it doesn't matter. Ouch! Ouch! Well, that's the next stuff that we want to get. But, you know, unfortunately, if you're attacking like the chicken, it's not going to help you out that much. Let's see, Gary Tan. Why do I recognize that name? Oh, if he fizzles here, we might be golden. Which, it looks like he's going to. Uh, I don't know what's going on with the Wi-Fi, but uh, let's bring it back. I assume we won that. I assume? Come on. Come on, Gary, give it to us. Uh, it doesn't look like the battle's going to end, but... Um, yeah, so that's it. That That's where we're at right now, guys. Uh, rock launchers, doom cannon. That's going to be able to push us forward. I just got to uh, figure out the attacks a little bit. Uh, did we get that one? There we go. There we go. Okay. So that's how they should be looking like. Guys, I hope that helps you out. As always, thank you so much for watching. That is going to wrap up the video today. Make sure to leave a like if you found it interesting, entertaining, or informative. And we'll see you next one. Guys, chicken out. Back, back.